4.30 on a beautiful afternoon, Sunday, December the 27th, 2020, making it two days after Christmas. And if you'll remember, Christmas was when that blizzard rolled in and collected so much snow on this cedar tree that it weighed it down, broke it, and it fell onto my old teardrop camper, the one that I, I lived in for the first about a year that I did this full time on the road. And it doesn't look like it broke through. But, uh, this morning, the sun came out and the skies are clear. A lot of the snow started melting. You see, I'm not in my big pet puffy jacket. I'm in uh, just the vest, so it's, the, it's time. It's time to crank up the chainsaw and clear this cedar tree off the old camper and assess just how much damage did it do. I already got in there and opened up the door and everything that I've stored in there looks like it's fine. It did not break through. I'm not seeing anything, but it's probably dented it pretty bad. Let's turn the camera around and let you guys get a better look at what's happened here. Yeah. And uh, that's the trailer I normally use to refill my water. So if I'm going to refill my water, I've got to do this too. But right there is where it broke. Kersnap. Right there. So this cedar tree had already had some kind of rotten place in it. You see a big rotten spot right there. And the, uh, the weight of the snow just kind of finished it off. And then this other one, smaller piece, below it also bent over and cracked and fell. One positive thing to come out of this is that once I've cleared all of this off, I am going to use this big cedar trunk here for an upright, I believe for an upright, on uh, the, the carport that I'm wanting to, to build for the newer camper. At any rate, I'm going to find uses for this cedar wood. Lots of uses for it. All right, let's get to it. now and we have mere minutes of daylight left so I'm gonna have to call this this done for the day let me give you guys a, a better look at just just how well this camper actually fared looking at it after clearing all that off okay I use this brush right here to clear the ice and the, the small branches off the top as best I could and that's how it looks. Yeah, that, that huge tree right there and all that landing on top of it, somehow, I don't even see a dent. I don't know how. I thought for sure I was gonna see a nice big bowl dent, a uh, long gash or something in there once I finally got all that off. But it looks like it's fine. Got the yeah, the screws aren't even at an angle or bent. Man, this this uh, this camper was a homemade jobby that I bought off of somebody on on eBay years and years ago. And whoever built this thing really, really built it hefty. Wow. Okay, so now it's a matter of processing all this getting this cleared off, deciding what goes into the burn pile and what can be salvaged and used for different projects that I've got coming up. 
this is cedar wood, so I'm going to use as much of it as I can. Yeah, so be watching the videos this summer. See what it is I do with all these these pieces of cedar. It's going to be fun. And as you guys can see behind me, it's sunset time. And so I'm... Uh, well, look at the moon. The moon is so bright. Wow. Yeah, that's going to be the perfect way to end off this little update video by giving you guys a nice shot. I'm going to go up there to the veranda so you guys can really see it good. A shot of an East Tennessee snowy sunset. And there it is. Wow. That is the, the beauty of creation right there. The best light show ever. Every every afternoon. I I thank my lucky stars every day that I'm able to come out to this veranda and see this view, this sunset. I don't, I don't deserve it. I feel so incredibly lucky to be able to have it. All right, so that is gonna be it for this one. Guys, if you've enjoyed it, please hit the thumbs up like button. Talk to you down in the comments. Subscribe if you haven't already. And, uh, Happy New Year. Happy New Year. And good riddance to 2020. I'm aware that 2021 does not mean everything is going to automatically fix itself. But hey. Good riddance to 2020. And Happy New Year to all of you. Oh, I hear Nestor coming out. You want to say goodbye to everybody too, Nestor? I know, I know, it's, it's, it's wet and cold. Wet and cold. I look forward to seeing all of you 